Okay, so I got some acoustic corner foam, a plant, and some floating shelves. So I'm gonna go ahead and proceed to check out. And I'm gonna go ahead and get these items on the way so that way I can get them for the studio. Cause I need some corner foam to go in the corner. I need some shelves and I need a little plastic plant. What's going on YouTube? Welcome to another beautiful day it is. And we have projects today. So since it's nice and sunny out, I got my dog and my rabbit out here chilling with me. But we are going to take apart that one case, the NZXT tape or the NZXT case, the white one. <coughs> We're gonna take it apart. I'm gonna clean the panels. I'm going to have to mask them off and then eventually I'm going to paint them. So that's one thing that we are doing today. The other awesome thing that I want to do today is go out in the studio and work a little. I went ahead and ordered some corner foam and uh, some more shelving and uh, a little plastic plant to kind of give me some flair. Going on guys, what's going on? So I have decided to do something. This is a NZXT case that I've talked about before in previous builds, or sorry, in previous videos. And what I would like to do is paint it because I want to chop it up and turn it into something. So what I've went ahead and did is started to take out the inside pieces to it. And we're going to mask off some of the stuff that I can't take out. And then I'll just take a razor blade and cut that out uh, that's what I'm started to do over here on the front panel we will have to take this door off and then take that black piece and then some of these LEDs and stuff out of here I went ahead and started removing one of the hinges so that's what I'm gonna do now there isn't anything all right so that's all from there that, that hinge like that there we go all right so I got the door off the door is off I'm just gonna set that to the side keep all my hardwares and screws together now the next thing I need to do is get this out remove our dust or anything on them when we go to wash them or when we go to paint it so we're just going to keep pulling all these parts out. Meanwhile, my bunny's seeking my attention. What do you want? Hmm? What do you want, bunny rabbit? Hey. Isabel. Hey, bunny. What you doing? Okay, so now I have all of my pieces ready and what we need to do now is we're going to, I'm probably actually going to have to take this off because I need to wash this. This needs to be scrubbed because I got to get rid of some of these scruff marks that are all over it. case that I was talking to you guys about, the NZXT case, the ones that fit those panels. Uh, I'm not exactly sure how I want to do this. Normally what you do is you take out the head of it, or I'm sorry, the, the bottom of it, this part right here, and you get rid of that drive, and you get rid of that drive cage, and you go like that. But those panels are only the front and the top. And then on top of that, I only have one panel and this is the back panel. I really wish I had the top panel to this, but I think I can maybe fix that. Maybe what I can do is cut this thing or go and have it cut 
somebody maybe with a laser can cut me out a window or something and then I can put a piece of plexiglass behind it and I'll solve my issues but what we're going to do is we're going to take this out in the garage here in the next video or two and we're going to unscrew it and stuff but what I need to do is I need to get it washed um, it's awfully dirty and I need to pull stuff like this out of it and everything else so I can get it painted and go from there I was thinking about maybe getting a hold of NZXT and seeing if they couldn't maybe send me a front panel for it uh, this is cool you don't normally see that anymore where all of the all the different types of motherboards that it takes or accepts but this case is awfully dirty and it does need to be cleaned before I do anything with it um, but I think and I might not clean it just yet because I do need to cut it up I mean you ever seen a computer case that's put together with screws I mean how often do you see that you know that's to me that's insane that's a rivet but we can get rid of that all right so that's what we're going to do so we're going to paint it a nice blue this is a two times paint it bonds to plastic see it says right there and I'm real curious to see what this color looks like So before I go any further, we'll try it out on this. There it is. It looks good. Now I just kind of have to let it sh the only problem is, is that there's little blemishes in the plastic, but I can't really help that. I try to, but it is what it is. Ha ha ha! New can of paint. Get rid of that. All right. Let's finish this before my sunlight goes away again. Now I'll probably have to coat this a few times. Alrighty. And then how about our piece over here? It's looking good. that's it all right so hopefully I don't get rained on and I can let this dry um, the next thing that I'm going to have to do is we're going to have to get the case out we're gonna to have to wash the case and then figure out where I'm going to cut it at and go from there oh there go my bunny uh -uh, don't you chew on that no Hey, that's not for you. Go on. No, go on. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, y'all be cool. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.